Kike Hernandez. Looking for his first big league hit right here. Kike Hernandez. The lefty fires. Not Count close Plano. with that one. And we're off and running from Anaheim. Yeah. Strike one to Kike Hernandez. Ball and that's right outside. Now. Spoils a two-strike pitch, and he'll see another. Kicks and fires. Way yeah. high there. Three and two now. Yeah. He battled for a long time, but it finishes with a strikeout. You can't be mad at yourself after an at-bat like that one. And that's the first strikeout of his major league career. And it could be the first of many if he meets the goals he set for himself and the expectations others have for him. He doesn't want to just win games. He wants to dominate at this level. Do you think young pitchers could sometimes get too caught up in trying to rack up K's early in their career? Ooh, I think they can. It's kind of like a hitter that doesn't have power. The thrill is still hitting the ball over the fence. And so for a guy, even if he doesn't have power stuff or strikeout stuff, a strikeout is still something that makes him stick his chest out a little bit further. Rendon. And Betts oh. is set down. Time now for Dave Roberts' lineup for the Los Angeles Dodgers. This is one of the best teams in the league when it comes to drawing walks, Chris, so we'll probably see a very patient approach from them. Yeah, Boogie, that's often uh, what leads to a lot of runs scored. You get guys on base, you work that pitch count up for the opposing pitchers, and then you take advantage when they make mistakes, you get into that bullpen. You can Ball. tell that everyone up and down this lineup just comes in with a great plan of attack, a lot of patience, just like you said. One one now. Good Ball eye in that spot. Two outs, bases empty. Ball and three. another ball. Teoscar Hernandez to bat next. Two outs. Fouls one off out of play. Back to our left. 3 2 now. Gets a piece and stays alive. Anderson ready to work. Knocks that one away and we'll do it again. Two down, nobody on. Foul off again and it remains three and two. Payoff pitch. And a swing and a miss. And that's that. It's the Dodgers nothing. Angels coming up. You're watching the Freeway Series on the show. Back here at Angel Stadium. Now the starting pitcher in this one. Gavin Stone. And singing a special day for him. He's making his major league debut here. And I'm sure he's got some nerves. He'll be excited for that first pitch to be in and over with so that he can settle in to pitching just like he did in the minor leagues. Exciting moment. He's got his family in town. I think this moment's going to be a huge tone setter for his career. Taylor Moore, the leadoff batter, as he looks at ball one. And downstairs. Two balls, no strike.
Next offering ball. upstairs. I got three and And there's the automatic. One way to make a guy real uncomfortable to play is pound him inside with good velocity. They're doing that right here. The pitch. And that's Ooh. too high, ball four. Maybe a little loss of focus on the mound right there. And Pretty much gifted in first base with the quick three pass. And next for the Angels, Zach Neto. First pitch, and that's in for a strike. Ward aboard here at first with nobody out. Pulled down the line. This one hammered, but it's foul. Well, good solid contact right there. Just a bit out in front of that fastball. Got to try to stay on that back side just a little bit longer and see if you can do some damage. The pitch. Double play ball to second. The throw to second. Not in time no, at first. Great. It's a fielder's choice. Batting Batting third. Third. The first base. Nolan. 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 Nolan Shonwell, the next to hit for the Angels. Trying to pick up his first knock in the big leagues. Pickoff throw. Hey, and he's G -G. back in safely. That one nope. close, ruled the ball, and ball it's one, one to no. Play. Man at first, one away. Here's a 1-1. One, one. Out there to center. Kiermaier settles under it and makes the catch. That's out number two. All right, let's take a look at the Angels lineup. A really frustrating showing for them in their last game. Lots of traffic on the bases, but they left a ton of runners on base. Couldn't cash in their chances, Chris. They had plenty of chances. There's nobody to blame it on but themselves offensively. They just did a poor job converting in those situations. You have to figure out what's your plan going to be. Maybe watch some tape from the last game. Make the adjustment. So if you get those opportunities in this one, you've got... Ah, that ends the inning. So we take a break. End of one. And we're still scoreless. Top of the second, here's the veteran outfielder, Teoscar Hernandez. Hernandez measures six feet, two inches, 215 pounds. He joined the team as a free agent. That fastball, even though it's up, that's the velocity you want to go after. Low 90s, a lot better than trying to hit the high 90s. That's a fair ball down the right field line. Around first, heading for two. And his first big league hit is a double. Teoscar Hernandez with his first major league hit. And this is a moment I'm sure he'll never forget. Congrats. Yeah, great moment for him and his family. A guy works so hard and has to wait so long for this to happen. And when it does, it can kind of be overwhelming, Boog. You still have to stay locked in on the game, but it's great when you can take a minute to just appreciate what you've done and how hard you've worked to get here. And up to the plate is Will Smith. That Aye. one finds the zone, and that's strike one. Man at second. Foul back our way, and that's out of play. Oh, and two now. Bounced up the middle. Boots it. And this ball's going to wind up out of play. 
So a big That's time a costly player. mistake there. Will player. Smith with yeah, his yeah, first yeah. major league well, hit. Well. And this is a moment I'm sure he'll never forget. Congrats. Yeah, great moment for him and his family. A guy works so hard and has to wait so long for this to happen. And when it does, it can kind of be overwhelming, boy. You still have to stay locked in on the game, but it's great when you can take a minute to just appreciate what you've done and how hard you've worked to get here. And now it's Gavin Lux. And a foul ball. One on, nobody out. A run in here at the top of the second. Yeah, there's a ball. Two now. Swings and misses. It's a strikeout. Couldn't hit the fastball at the knees. Bogey just ran out of patience there. He took a couple of pitches to even that count up at two balls and two strikes, but that time chased outside the zone. Muncie to hit. Wouldn't oh, chase that time. And a foul ball. Smith, the runner at second with one away. Kicks and deals. Fouls it off, still one and two. Also really good at bat. What I like about this guy, his bat stays in the zone for a long time. Gives him the ability to foul off tough pitches. Gets a piece there, we'll do it again. Just misses with that ball. Really close pitch down around the knees there, and you could see him asking where it missed. Probably doesn't agree, but it appears he's ready to move on to the next pitch. Eighth pitch of the at-bat coming up. Next Out offering forward. way off the plate. Foul ball left side. He'll see another. for him on the mound, but they still get the strikeout. Not too often you're going to see a sub-90 mile per hour fastball get by a hitter for the strikeout, especially when it's in a very hittable location like that. Makes me think he's either looking for something else completely or he tried to do way too much that swing. Miguel Rojas at the plate. That one out to right. Adele grabs it on the run. One run on two hits, an error, and one left on. We go to the bottom of inning number two. It's the Dodgers one and the Angels nothing. We head to the bottom of the second, and now the designated hitter for the Angels, Logan O'Hoppy. O'Hoppy. As he turns on the rubber, and with that good live arm delivers. Hey. And a big swing and a miss. Oh, 
Good eye right there. Doubled up on the slider away. Two seamer here. Just watch and see. And the righty deals. And Whoa, another right ball. There. That That's one okay. misses. Three and one. And that's in for a strike. Okay. Outside, nope, and that is ball Take four. Well, he tried to nibble right there and just missed his spot. And go. Hitter didn't oh, offer at it. Now he has somebody to worry about over at first. Mickey. So digging in, Mickey Moniak. Close, but called the ball. Ball one. At the belt and fires. There's a strike. Eric Summers Gill, our plate umpire. One thing to watch out for, Boog, is what side of the plate Summers Gill might be favoring. He usually sets up at an angle. Pitchers sometimes will try to figure that out early so they can attack that spot and get as many strike calls as possible. Here goes the runner. That's out to center field. And there's one down. Brandon Drury to the play. Definitely wants to stay out of the double play here. Ball on the ground in the infield. Should be an inning ending double play. And that one fouled off. Here comes the 01. That one, one missed. Tying run is at first. Bottom half of inning number two. And the right hater deals. Got him swinging. Pulled the string of the changeup. Way out in front of that inside pitch there. Just exactly the opposite kind of approach that you want with two strikes. You want to let the ball travel. Make sure you recognize it. Try to shorten up so that you can at least put the ball in play. Clearly fooled, but I think even more so, you question the two-strike approach. Matt Thice comes up to hit here. That one a little bit high, and that is ball one. Foul ball there. Left hand hitter waits. There's a swing and a miss. One ball, two strikes. Rex and misses. It's a strikeout. No runs on no hits, no errors, and a runner left. We head on now to the top of the third. It's the Dodgers one and the Angels nothing. Back in Anaheim, here's Kevin Kiermeyer. This is a guy who's in the lineup first and foremost because of what he contributes defensively, Chris. And when you talk about preventing runs from being scored hey. this guy is a big contributor you'll want drilled out towards left center field that's well struck Ward running hard to get it high get bounce double, takes double. it over the fence for an automatic double Kevin Kiermaier with his first major league hit and this is a moment I'm sure he'll never forget congrats yeah, great moment for him and his family. A guy works so hard and has to wait so long for this to happen. And when it does, 
can kind of be overwhelming, Boog. You still have to stay locked in on the game, but it's great when you can take a minute to just appreciate what you've done and how hard you've worked to get here. Here's Kike Hernandez. And there's one thing on his mind this at bat, getting that first hit at the big league level. Right through there for a strike. Man at second. Fouled off down the right side. see how hard it is these guys are great man they have the ability to look out there but also to be able to turn on the inside pitch those that can really sharpen things on the outer half those are the ones that become elite swings and sends a rocket to right Again, makes the grab and there's two gone oh, no, 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 no. the first base spreading out here comes Freddie Freeman up to hit. He struck out swinging at his first at bat. Though Chris, through the early stages, he hasn't been very efficient in terms of the pitch count. He's going to need to get some quick outs if he's going to get deeper into this game. That misses. One and one. It is interesting, though, when you consider the way the game is run now doesn't even matter that much if your starter doesn't go that deep because teams are really aggressively building their bullpens. One and two here. On the ground, right side. Drury. The throw to first. And that is that. One left for L.A., but they still lead it one nothing. The white field. Stone back to work. This one popped up middle of the infield. Rojas right there to make the grab. One down. Oh, that's a frustrating no, into the at bat for the hitter right there. I mean, that pitch was right down the middle. I think he got a little too excited, came out of his mechanics, and instead of driving that ball somewhere, he popped it up. Unfortunate for him. Ward the in the ball. box with one away as he takes Count ball one. Oh. one. Swing and a miss. And the count one and one. Feel the change up right there. Just pulled the string. Next nope, pitch is inside. inside. Two and one. That one blasted deep to right. Betts going back. He won't get there. That should be extra bases. He's in at second with a one out double. Taylor Ward with his first major league hit. And this is a moment I'm sure he'll never forget. Congrats. Yeah, great moment for him and his family. A guy works so hard and has to wait so long for this to happen. And when it does, it kind of be overwhelming, dude. You still have to stay locked in on the game. But it's great when you can take a minute to just appreciate what you've done and how hard you worked to get here. Now it's the shortstop, Zach Neto. 0 for 1, he hit into a fielder's choice his first time. That one finds the corner. Strike one.
Right hander kicks deals. This to third. Jump throw across his body. He's awesome up. play there. Now My goodness, Chris. He had to generate a ton of power in that jump throw for the out. Let's take another look and dive into the numbers from StatCast. Man, that's an impressive throw right there. In the air, all the way from third base. You've got to have a powerful arm to play third base, but he just showed he's got more than enough. He's got a cannon. So two down now, and here is Nolan Shonwell. There's a strike. Oh, and one. Second two down. Swing and a fly ball in the air out towards right center field. Drops into the glove, and that is the inning. Angels strand one. They're down one nothing. Back for more of the freeway series. Out of the fourth, and now Teoscar Hernandez. The wind of the pitch. Swings and misses. Strike one. You know, these Dodgers did a great job, Boog, of just waiting for the right pitch to come their way. And I'm seeing very patient bats out of him. He's only given up one run, but the starter's pitch count is starting to get up there, and that might be the best news yet for this offense. Misses and misses. It's a strikeout. Wow, short work to send them back in to start the inning and no messing around either. All three pitches were in the strike zone, attack mode all the way, and that's pretty impressive given the pop he was dealing with at the plate. The batter now will be Will Smith. That nope. misses. Ball one. ball one. You know, sometimes all it takes is getting to the next arm before an offense does any damage, and that might be the case today. One out, base is empty. And that one got a piece of him. He had him one, two, and he ends up hitting him with a pitch. Gavin Lux steps to the plate for the Dodgers. He was a strikeout victim his first time. And immediately pumps in a strike to the left-handed hitter. Smith at first, one gone. Ball one, one low. One and one. Swing and a miss, and that's strike two. One ball. Clearly was sitting on a fastball right there and just ended up out in front of the slider. Hey, you can't fault him for his commitment. Now he's just going to have to battle with two strikes. And a pitch. Foul ball still a one and two count. Three. Swing and a miss, and he got him. Picks up strikeout number seven. Well, that's always the key to effective pitching is getting ahead in the count. And as a pitcher, it really allows you to start expanding the zone. Hitters become defensive, and all of a sudden that plate starts to get really wide. And what happens is, because of the pressure, you end up committing to a pitch as a batter before you recognize what it is, and that's what leads to the strikeout. Just missed. No, he's really working him away this at bat. Sometimes take a little bit off velocity. Try to get a rollover, something on the ground. Stay away from that big hole on the right side of the infield. And now two and one. Two balls, one strike. Two 
swing and a miss as he was late. Two balls, two strikes. Just misses the mark outside the zone. 3-2, two, two out, runner on first. A lot of movement in the infield. Hitters got to stay focused on the pitch. Base hit, center field. Throw in, holds the lead runner at second. Two on now with two away. Max Muncy with his first major league hit. And this is a moment I'm sure he'll never forget. Congrats. Yeah, great moment for him and his family. A guy works so hard and has to wait so long for this to happen. And when it does, it can kind of be overwhelming, dude. You still have to stay locked in on the game, but it's great when you can take a minute to just appreciate what you've done and how hard you worked to get here. First and second, two down. Miguel Rojas steps to the plate for the Dodgers. Clips the corner. It's 0-1. Two outs, a couple of base runners at first and second. Ripped on the ground a second, third He's out. out. Dodgers strand a couple, but they hold a one nothing lead. Bottom of the fourth, and now it's Anthony Rendon. The third baseman, Anthony Rendon. The right-hander back to work. Edge of the zone for a strike, and it's 0-1. He's been one. pitching well, but we'll see what kind of adjustment the hitters make this second time through the order. We'll know if he's got really good stuff in this one or not. That takes care of Rendon, and there's one down. The bat. The designated hitter. Now it's the DH for the Angels. Logan O'Hoppy. He reached out a walk his first time. And a pop-up. Right side. Foul territory. Smith calls it in. And there's two away. Boy, that was a hanging, breaking ball right there. I think he tried to do a little bit too much. Sometimes those eyes can get really big. I think his swing broke down as well, and that's what caused him to pop it up. And next for the Angels, Mickey Moniak. Trying to get him to chase on the changeup that time. That clips the corner. Two outs. On the ground, right side. Lux gathers and throws to first. Play made, that ends the inning. Nothing doing for the offense that time. We played four. It's the Dodgers one and the Angels nothing. Here at Angel Kevin Stadium, Don, Don, Don. top five, John Shami with Chris Singleton. Kevin, Kevin. And leading it off, Kier Kevin Kiermeyer. And a pitch. That hey. one finds the zone. That's strike one. Sharp grounder. That's through for a base hit. So now back to the top of the order. Wasting no time. He's two for two now on the night. And just a triple and home run away from the cycle. Seriously, we're starting with this already. Back to the top of the Dodgers order. And now here's the Dodgers designated hitter, Kike Hernandez. That's a ball. First offering, and it just misses. Hernandez, 32 years old, and he was born in Puerto Rico. Here comes a pitch. Swing and a foul over the screen and back out of play. Instead of letting the hitter get his arms extended. 
tied him up a little bit. Slightly up, slightly in. Now it's belted. Deep to left. Way out of here. Home run. And that should quiet this home crowd. And they tack on to their lead. It's 3-0. That was blasted. Absolutely no doubt off the bat. When you're lacking velocity, it's so critical that you move the ball around, change speeds, even try to trick the hitter at times. But when you give up a home run right there, manager doesn't have a lot of patience because the velocity is not there to overcome and get the swing and miss. Now it's Mookie Betts. Oh. Missed with a changeup. 1 and 0. Oh. The wind and the pitch. Right through there for a strike. You know, Boog, Mookie Betts may have not been named MVP in 2023, but that doesn't take away from his impressive season. The Dodgers star hit nearly 40 home runs and drove in more than 100. Ronald Acuna Jr. deserved to win, but it was another phenomenal season in Mookie's career. Monia calls it in, and there's one away. The first base of the Freddie Freeman up to the dish. Part of the order coming through now, and with one home run already in this inning, they're definitely looking to do some more damage. Swing and a pop-off in foul ground. Rendon drifts towards it. Two down. It's a good recovery, though, after giving up the home run. Not allowing it to stay in the head, but going to work at the next hitter. And a tough one at that. Here's Teoscar Hernandez. One for two. <laughs> Fought off foul. Next offering is in for a strike. Activity in the bullpen for the Angels. Samuel Aldegary, the lefty, looks to be getting himself ready. Kochanowitz also getting ready. Two runs across in the inning, and we're at the top of the fifth. Two down, nobody on. That one just that. misses. Yeah, the count one and two. It's a good take. Fights that one away. Still one and two. Two outs. That's ball two. Two two. Yeah. And that one is inside. Wow, this guy's really battling up there as if. His run is the game-winning run. I love his tenacity. That's foul off to the right side. Keeps the A.B. going. Well, he's desperately looking for that swing and miss. He's going to have to just change speeds a little bit, try to move it around, create just a little bit of illusion at the end. Grinding A.B. right here. About to see pitch number 10. High fly ball out towards left field. On its way. Gone. He doinks it off the foul pole. That one felt good. Second home run of the inning for him. It's 4 nothing. He kept swinging and it paid off. Well, that was a battle, Boog, again. he just kept taking his cuts. Finally squared one up. Well, he really crushed that thing down the line, and everyone had to hold their breath until it clanked off the pole. And every time that happens, it just kind of feels like a trick shot or something. But really, it's just a stroke of luck that it stays fair long enough. So two away with nobody on. Will Smith steps to the plate for the Dodgers. 
And strike one to the catcher. Oh, one's the count. We'll see you win. No ball, two strikes. One ball, chase that time. two strikes. Pitch that misses there. Two and two. Great job of two laying balls. off those pitches down in the zone to even the count up at two and two. Such a better feeling for the hitter. And he deals. This ball's chopped to the ground. Tosses to first. And they get the out on Smith. And the inning is over. But two round trippers in this inning. The long ball was working. It's now a four nothing ball game. Back after this on the show. And welcome back and to the ballpark. The now it's the second baseman, the Brandon second baseman. Drury. Brandon the Drury. The pitch. That ball. misses the zone, and that's ball one. You know, these Angels just haven't produced as many competitive at-bats as I'd like to see in this one. I think things are happening a little quicker than this offense would like, and we see it in the numbers. They're hitting into a lot of outs early in the at-bat. That's in there. It's a ball and two strikes. Righty to the plate. Lays out, but he can't squeeze it. Gets it there in time, though, and they come away with an out after a tricky start to the play. Just a great effort all the way around at third base right there. Nice job to get a glove on it with the dive, but it was the recovery that was so impressive. If he doesn't hop to his feet and get the throw off in such a fluid motion over there, I kind of doubt he gets the out. Matt Theis, the next to hit for the Angels. 0 for 1, he struck out swinging last time. And it's fouled away. The Dodgers leading by four. Last half of inning number five. Swing and a pop up. Foul territory for the catcher. Hauls it in for the out. The right fielder, number seven, Joe. Adele. Two outs, space is empty. And now the right fielder, Joe Adele. First time up was a pop out. He's controlling things out there on the mound, not messing around at all. He's been in attack mode since the very start. There's your strike. He's gotten into a really good rhythm, set down seven in a row. He just wants to get the baseball and deliver it as quickly as possible. Now this ball is well hit. This one's got a chance. That one outs against the fence. And that's a two-out double. Joe Adele with his first major league hit. And this is a moment I'm sure he'll never forget. Congrats. Yeah, great moment for him and his family. A guy works so hard and has to wait so long for this to happen. And when it does, it can kind of be overwhelming, Boog. You still have to stay locked in on the game, but... It's great when you could take a minute to just appreciate what you've done and how hard you've worked to get here. Now it's the Angels' leadoff man, Taylor Ward. And that's in for a strike. 0-1. Way outside, going to count one and two.
Swing and a miss. That one in the dirt. And it's in time for the third out, so that'll end the inning. And the runner stays where he is. Angels leave one. They're down 4 nothing. We're back, and they make a change to start the sixth. The new pitcher, Caden Dana, on for his major league debut. So we'll see if he's ready for the big stage. He just has to remember this is the same game that he's played all the way through the minor leagues to this point. The only difference, there are just more people in the stands and it's a bigger stadium, but the game itself is still the same. Look at the catcher, whatever fingers he puts down, that's what you throw, and just let him lead you in this one. Bounce to the left side, and it goes just foul. You know, these Dodgers really impressing me with the quality of their bats in this one. It's been fun getting a chance to see them go to work. They really made that opposing starter work in this one. Ran his pitch count off, and now they've got an opportunity to continue making things difficult on the bullpen. One that ball. misses the zone, and a count one and two. And no, they haven't broken through in a big way in the runs column, but with the way they're grinding out at bats, it definitely feels like there's potential for more coming. This one lifted in the air, left field. Ward makes the grab on the run. Now back. Third, Third base. base. Max. Max. Here comes Max Muncy. With this kind of lead, he can swing freely. Try to hit the ball out of the park. Do what he loves to do. That's in there. 1-1. Action in the Angels bullpen. Samuel Aldegary up and throwing. Kochanowitz getting loose as well. Base is empty one away, and we're the top half of the sixth. Tap dances out of the way of that one. Now fly ball to right center. Moniak under it. Two down. The batter, number 11. Two outs, base is empty. Miguel and the batter will be the shortstop, Miguel Rojas. Right through there for a strike. Oh, one's the count. Next offering in there for a strike. Oh, a two down. Quickly down 0 2 in the count. I think you got to choke up a little bit, spread out the feet. You don't know what the velocity or the location of this next pitch is going to be. Two down, nobody on. A swing and a soft liner. And makes the play, and that's out number three. No runs, no hits, no errors. Two, three, four, due up in the home half of the sixth. It's the Dodgers four, and the Angels nothing. Back in Anaheim, and down the number two eight. hitter, Zach Neto. That's your stop. The pitch. That one fouled off. On the corner for a strike, and it's 0-2. It really looks like these hitters have been in between with their timing today. Good fastball, Ball, excellent inside. slider, but they've not been able to commit to one velocity and stay there. And a 1-2 again. The punch out there, one away. He's really good hitting the baseball the other way. So credit the pitcher for having him out in front of that pitch. Clearly he had him fooled. Nolan Shadowell getting ready to hit. Misses outside. And that's ball one. The Halos down by four here in the bottom of the sixth. Late swing, foul to the left. Righty delivers. Ball two. That one called just inside, I think, and on the mound. 
trying to get a little bit of an explanation. Doesn't seem to be too bothered by it, though, but he clearly thought it clipped the corner. Pitch misses ball. there, and a count is three and one. Here's an opportunity to do some damage and perhaps unlock this offense. Three one count. Be ready to turn on a fastball. But why to kick the pitch? Hard grounder into the outfield for a now. So a man aboard now with one away. Nolan Shonwell with his first major league hit. And this is a moment I'm sure he'll never forget. Congrats. Yeah, great moment for him and his family. A guy works so hard and has to wait so long for this to happen. And when it does, it can kind of be overwhelming, Boog. You still have to stay locked in on the game, but... It's great when you could take a minute to just appreciate what you've done and how hard you've worked to get here. Runner on at first with one gone. Anthony Rendon now at the plate. And there's a foul ball. Now these guys definitely looking for a big swing of the bat right here. Try to close that gap. But, you know, at the very least, if you could find a way to manufacture that run from first, it feels like it's really important to getting back into this ballgame. And the pitch. And a foul ball. And a foul ball. He stays alive. It by him for the K. Now battle. Next is the designated hitter, Logan O'Hoppy. He's all for one. And first offering is fouled off. Two outs. Swing and a miss. And it's 0-2. Tonight, his slider has been really impressive. I mean, tight spin. Seems like the hitters aren't picking it up out of the hand. Just outside. And the count is 1-2. and two. Really good slider. He's up there just hoping that it ends up off the plate away. And another ball. Shanowell leads off first with two down to the inning. Wouldn't chase that time. Great RBI spot here. Just got to stay focused on the pitch. The runner will be in motion, so something in the gap should definitely score. That one is absolutely belted. That'll make it out of here. He made him pay for that one. His first homer of the year, and they close the gap. It's 4-2. He just sent a jolt of electricity into this stadium with that swing. Well, that one got in the jet stream on a line drive. We saw the numbers on the backs of the jerseys of the outfielders, which is usually bad news, and... All of a sudden, they're back in this ballgame. Two outs, nobody on. And next for the Angels, Mickey Moniak. And the first pitch misses for ball one. Out to short, Rojas. Wide throw pulls him off the bag, and the oh, inning still be. alive. The second base. That's a play you expect your shortstop to make pretty much every time. Pretty routine. Hard to tell if he didn't get a great grip on it or the mechanics on him just broke down, but that gives this offense an extra out to work with. Bet at first. 
Brandon Drury digs in now. That one missing inside. And a 1 0. Swing and a miss. Strike one. I got a ball, one strike. And a pitch. Battling here as he fouls it away. Kicks and fires. And right back to the mound. Over to first. That ends the inning. But not before they're able to draw closer with this blast. It's now 4-2. You're watching Major League Baseball on the show. And we're back. We go to the top of the seventh. Now the batter now, Kevin Kiermeyer. He's someone that you might not describe as having elite level speed, but he can absolutely move, and it is a factor in his game. Dana back to work. Gets the call. Going on. Well, this guy's oh, definitely one. a plus runner, but what I love about him is that he goes all out every single time, never takes a break. It's oh, guys one. like that, even though they don't have the elite one. speed, the fact that they're consistent with it, they make moves on the base paths. Swings through that one for strike two. One ball, two strikes. Keeps the at bat going with a foul ball. Swing and a miss struck him out. Very frustrating right there as a speedy potential base runner when the two strikes, you just struggle to put the ball in play. You don't even have to get a hit at that point. You can help your team just by reaching on an error, but some way you got to find a way to shorten up the swing and put the ball in play next time. So now the DH spot, Enrique Hernandez. Can't forget the two-run shot he launched out of here in the fifth. Yeah, one of the biggest swings of the game, Boog, as he looks to make even more of an impact in this at bat right here. First oh, pitch, and he just misses. Strike. And Two there's balls. a ball. No strike. Two oh. And a foul ball. One down, base is empty. Ball. And another ball. Three balls, one strike. Yeah, there's ball, ball four. four. Pretty easy walk right there. Last pitch wasn't even much to think about. Now bad. One gone right runner at first. Mookie. Here's Mookie Betts now. Yes. Chris, baseball today, so many strikeouts, and they are available to pitchers. But this is a guy that puts the bat Inside, on the ball, ball and is kind of different from the players that we see day in, day out. Turns and fires the bats. Foul ball there. Yeah, his swing is so good. It's in the zone a long time. He gets the barrel to it a lot, and that produces more base hits. Ground ball up the middle. That's a base hit. They fired in quickly, so it's first and second with only one away. Mookie Betts with his first major league hit, and this is a moment I'm sure he'll never forget. Congrats. Yeah, great moment for him and his family. A guy works so hard and has to wait so long for this to happen. And when it does, it can kind of be overwhelming for you. You still have to stay locked in on the game, but it's great when you can take a minute to just appreciate what you've done and how hard you worked to get here. Freddie Freeman steps to the plate for the Dodgers. Wormburner into the outfield for a knock. 
Runner around third on his way to the plate. He'll score, and they take a three-run lead. Now so he gets two hit. milestones with that ball. hit, his first, first big hit. league knock, and he drives in his first run as well. Yeah, you love to get both of those out of the way with just one swing of the bat, and it makes the special moment even more special. It's not just an individual accomplishment when you're also driving in a run for your team. That's an at-bat he's never going to forget. Two on, one out. Teoscar Hernandez steps to the plate for the Dodgers. Swing and a tapper that rolls foul. Hey, swing to miss. Sometimes being lucky is a swing and miss. If he makes contact with that pitch, probably hits into a double play. Oh, he doesn't get the call. Down one, ball, one and two. Kind of break right there. Pretty good pitch on the outside corner. On the ground. Base hit. Rounds third, headed for the plate. The throw in. The tag, and he's safe. Well done, drives in the run. Just a simple ground ball the other way that had eyes on it, man. Sometimes that's all you need to do. Just let the ball travel, put the ball in play, and just hope it finds a hole. Samuel Aldeguer on the pitch out of the pen here. On for his major league debut and a moment he will never forget. Yep, you better believe that. It's always so special the first time you get into a big league ball game. I did it as a position player, but for him, as a pitcher, I'm sure there's some nerves there. Probably don't want to squeeze the baseball too tight. Just relax and do what you're capable of doing. Now a chance for Will Smith. Freeman over at second. Hernandez at first. One gone. Fouled off. He was late. Ball to strike. The pitch. And well, there's the strike. Well, that's really the money spot. Down and away. If you can locate that consistently, it's going to be real tough for hitters to square that up. That's what you love to see relievers do coming out of that bullpen. Two on, one out. Bows it off. Still one and two. Next offering is outside. Good miss with that changeup away. He needs a ball on the ground for a double play. Minimize the potential threat right here. On the hitter side, nice job of laying off that pitch. Wouldn't hey, chase oh. that time. The Dodgers trying to break this one open. Here in the top half of inning number seven. Side and that is ball four. Got a great back and forth and that at bat. He had to lay off some really close pitches and somehow Boogie found a way to keep the bat on his shoulder right there. I'll tell you right now, I couldn't have done it. Lice batting with one down takes a strike. Tough situation right here. So important as a pitcher to get ahead in the count as he did right there. On the ground, could be two. To second, there's Out. one. Over to first, Reset. safe. Oh, I promise you, they're guys that get a little bit faster when they can smell an RBI. Yeah. That was a possible inning, ending double play. Great hustle, and he gets rewarded with the RBI because of it. Here's Max Muncie, that funky Muncie. One for three. Inside Aye. corner at the knees for a strike. Oh, one's the count. Yeah, 
Lefty out of the stretch. Runners at first and third. That one ripped. Dives and he can't hang on. One run is in. Coming home. Now a relay to the plate. And he's out. Down and that ends the inning. So four runs on four hits. Goers and a runner left on. Seventh inning stretch time. It's the Dodgers eight and the Angels two. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. Here's the Angels catcher, Matt Theis. And hey. there's the strike. 0-1. Oh the pitch. Hard hit, left side. Throw on to Freeman, oh. and one away in the bottom of the seventh. Now batting, right fielder, Joe Adele. Joe Adele, the next to hit for the Angels. In the air, out to center. Kiermaier moving under it. He's got it, there's two away. Now batting, left fielder, Taylor. So the batting Ward. order turns over. Now it's the Angels' leadoff man, Taylor Ward. Eight. Right through there for a strike. Next inside pitch misses one. inside, and the count is one and one. Two down, nobody on. Swing and a miss. Looked off balance that time. Two I think three. he was sitting off speed there. Next offering is in the dirt. In the air, right field. Betts settles underneath it. Pulls it down, and he makes the catch. And that's the third out. We go to the eighth. There's the shortstop at the play. Miguel Rojas. Alda Gary back to work. That misses the zone, and it's one to know. Alda Gary goes six foot one, 180 pounds, and he was born in Italy. Fastball for a strike. And here it comes. Swing and a ball popped up. And there's one down. Now that the center field. Kevin. Here's Kiermaier now. Pretty amazing going way back. Possibly the best center fielder I've ever seen. First pitch, not close. That's in there. Base is empty, one away, and we're in the top of the eighth. In for a strike. One and two. They tried to get him to chase on a slider down and away. The only adjustment he needs to make is his target. If you aim at the outside corner, that slider's going to end up way off the plate. Perhaps look a little more down the middle, and you get it right where you want it. 2-2 two -two now. And they'll do it again. Just missed. And that's awfully close. I don't know how you take that. He's seeing the ball out of the pitcher's hand really well. Pulled the string of the changeup. This guy will throw any pitch at any count. 3-2. He goes off speed. Gets the out. So the lineup flips over. Stepping in, Kike Hernandez. He's already homered in this game. And a base hit up the middle. 
And that extends the inning for Mookie Betts. Well, that started and ended pretty quickly. No messing around right there. Timing on the swing was good. Able to shoot the ball up the middle. Didn't square it up as much as he probably would have liked, but that's a good approach paying off. Here's Mookie Betts. Line drive. Nice grab. Make a great catch like that. It's all about timing the jump. His timing was perfect. Excellent grab, and he comes down with it. The inning is over. Back now, now new pitcher on the mound as we roll into the bottom of the eighth, Daniel Hudson. Yeah, this is the best way to make your major league debut. No one on base. Yeah, you're already going to be a little nervous out there, so I think it's a nice job by the skipper to get him in here without any added pressure with traffic on the bases. And now the shortstop, Zach Neto. 0 for 3 with two ground outs and a strikeout. And a pitch. The shortstop takes a ball. I can't play around with him here. It's a six-run lead at this point. Got to attack hitters even if you give up a solo shot. And that one fouled off. And the righty deals. Nope, and that's, that's a ball. little bit high. And it's two and one. pitch and down on strikes he goes leadoff man is out here in the eighth now Nolan Shadowell the next to hit for the Angels and there's the strike double barreled action in the bullpen Alex Vesia looks to be getting ready for manager Dave Roberts Otani, the right-hander, also getting loose. One down, base is empty. Ball, that's low. So, a foul ball makes it one and two. The Dodgers up big in this one. Here, the bottom half of the eighth inning. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. And there's two away. Stood absolutely no chance now on that slider down. right there. And I don't mean to laugh, but that's a tough one. I mean, pretty much a perfect strikeout pitch. I mean, it looks like a fastball middle in. Kind of has cutter action, and it just bunches you up to where you can't get your hands through and the barrel to it. And not much you can do unless you recognize the spin early and you spit on it. Two outs. Stays alive. And a good eye there. Really good take, especially with two strikes. Pitch misses. It's two and two. Swing and a foul straight back. And another ball. Good battle here. About to be the eighth pitch of the at bat. Fights it off. You'll see another. Well, he's having a tough time getting a pitch by him. As a hitter, you feel pretty confident that you're seeing different pitches still able to make some type of contact. Two down, nobody on. Foul. We'll see another payoff pitch.
kicks and deals. Gets a piece and stays alive. Right handed reliever. Got him swinging. And the Angels are gone in order. And it's still 8 2. Here at we Angel Stadium, we go to the ninth, the and at the plate for the Dodgers, Freddie Freddy Freeman. Freeman. The wind of the pitch. There's a swing and a drive. Could be extra bases. Around first and hustling for second. In safely, it's a double and his second hit. Well, that'll make you feel good as a hitter right there. Really good swing right there. He got a pitch that he knew he could handle, allowed himself to stay back just a tad bit longer, and he hit the ball on the screws. Teoscar Hernandez, the next to hit. And it may be a long shot, but a triple here will give him the cycle. And first offering is fouled off. Runner in scoring position, nobody out. Here at the top of the ninth. That's and that's downstairs and outside. Nasty backdoor slider. There's really nothing you can do with that if you swing at it. So that's a good take by him. Hard grounder into the outfield for a knock. Around third. Fires it to the plate. It's offline. The run comes in. And it's 9-2. Everything came together for him. Couldn't get any air under him, but he smoked that ball back up the middle. Timing was just perfect. Got great wood on it, and there's just no chance for the infielders with how hard he hit it. Next to hit, Will Smith. First round pick out of Louisville in 2016. And that one hammered. And it's a one hopper off. The wall should be extra bases. The run scores from first, extending their lead, and it's now 10-2. No, no, no. Just a total nightmare yeah. for lefties. I'd be whoa, very whoa. surprised to see that matchup again. Got a good pitch to drive, stayed short with his bad path to the ball, and caught it out front, and he stayed long in his follow through. And that's how you split the gap, and that's pretty much a double every time. So, man aboard. Gavin Lux steps to the plate for the Dodgers. Ball Just one. missed. Ball one, no strike. The pitch. Popped in the air. Left field. He's got it. Muncie digs in. Number 13. Max Muncie. And that's in there at the knees. Left hand hitter waits. Sliced hard but foul. At the belt and fires. Struck him out swinging. Pulled the string on the changeup. Miguel Rojas that, getting ready to hit. Miguel. He's kind of an outlier, especially when guys are consciously sacrificing contact to deliver power. And first offering is fouled off. Man at second. That pitch gets the corner. That's strike two. No ball, two strikes. And he deals. And now one and two. 
pretty standard high O2 fastball right there. If you're smart, you'll look for something down in the zone, but not too far. Don't want to chase that breaking ball in the dirt. Popped up. That's a base hit. They extend their lead as the runner scores from second. And it's 11-2. So he gets two milestones with that hit. His first big league knock. And he drives in his first run as well. Yeah, you love to get both of those out of the way with just one swing of the bat. And it makes the special moment even more special. It's not just an individual accomplishment when you're also driving in a run for your team. That's an at-bat he's never going to forget. reliever out of the pen Hunter Strickland well they need someone to stop the bleeding and keep the score right where it is seems like a tough task today with the way this lineup is swinging it and now the center fielder Kevin Kiermeyer. swing and a miss as he was late that time Two outs. Ball. Just missed. Lined into right. Adele makes the catch, and that'll do it. Three runs on four hits, no errors, and one left on. Five, six, and seven will leave things off in the bottom of the ninth. It's the Dodgers 11 and the Angels 2. And welcome back and to the ballpark. The All Angels. set for the bottom of the, the ninth. Leading game. off, Logan O'Hoppy. O'Hoppy. Oh, and the right hater back to work. Ball, Just right off the outside edge. And that is ball one. There's a strike. Good heater at 98. Big at bat right here. He did the team thing. Took until he got a strike. Now he's got to go to work. Shorten up that swing a little bit. Do whatever it takes to get on base. The 1-1. One, one. Best ball for a strike. Well, it looks like he's one wanting ball. to work the upper Two part strike. of the strike zone. What does that mean? Top hand better be working for the hitters. Adjust that side a little bit. Give yourself a chance to hit. Is the fastball up the ladder struck him out man there was no deviating from the fastball right there he just kept coming Seven after him with it here 15. it is hit it if you can and he just couldn't find a way to put it in play Monia yeah. now in the box comes up empty with a oh swing my. there On the ground, right side. Lux throws the first in time. Now only one out now remaining. Right. Second base Brandon Drury. And next for the Angels, Brandon Drury. Misses outside. 1 and 0. Oh. And oh, another dude. ball. Right hander kicks deals. Outside, that's a ball. The Angels with a lot of ground to make up here at the last half of inning number nine. Next offering is in for a strike. Hey. 
This could end it. Foul ball, and it remains a full count. And a pitch. And a foul ball. He stays alive. Eighth pitch of the at-back coming up. And that's ball four. It wasn't easy, but he earned that walk after a long at-bat. Well, that's a nice job of grinding oh, out that at-bat. Saw a lot of pitches Looks and ends up drawing the wall. Very gritty. Here's the catcher, Matt Theis. Close one doesn't get the call. And that's ball one. Left hand batter waits. Swings through that one for strike one. Drury off of first with two away. Clearly trying to stay back a little bit longer for that changeup as he fells that fastball back. A one two knocks that one away and we'll do it again the pitch good oh, eye in that ball. spot that turns out to be a really good take right there but you don't want to end this game with the bat on your shoulder done I'm sure he'll feel very good about that and get the ball for his trophy case as he should a start he won't ever forget 11 to the final tally Dave Roberts and company celebrate in the dugout for Chris Singleton and our entire crew here at MLB the show thanks for stopping by I'm John Chambi talk to you soon